here is the finished product. I'm not an expert sewer. I actually don't sew at all. I learn by myself. And do a close up. I'm gonna have to use fray glue to make sure that the edges don't fray. But you'll see that I hand sewed the pockets. The up to the pockets and then I mas machine sewed all the way down and then here I sewed one line across and I have a little like extra left over just in case but I'll probably cut that off later and this is following the seam that's on top of the pocket and then in front of the leg seam. Fold the pants according to its natural seams. And then line the start of the braid right below the belt section all the way down to the bottom of the pants, leaving an inch to fold inside the pants. Now we're going to pin the braid in place. Make sure the pants is flat and you pin the braid right against the pocket and seam. Also make sure your pin head is facing toward the foot so it's easy to pull them out while you're using the sewing machine. Once we reach the end, we can cut the braid. Just be sure to leave an inch or an inch and a half so we have leeway and we can fold the extra length inside. Now we want to sew the top of the braid, one line across. Remember to backstitch so that you can secure the sew.
machine sew the side of the braid. Starting right below the pocket area since we don't want to sew the pockets shut. Make sure that you're only sewing one side of the pants and not both sides because I've definitely accidentally done that multiple times. I like to place my left hand inside the pants leg so I can make sure that I'm only sewing one side. Once you get to the end, backstitch to secure it in place. Okay, let's see if I actually sewed anything or It's just the belly's too dark, so I can't see. Okay. Let's see if that did anything. What the fuck? Okay, so... This is what happens when you use black under thread. And I guess it's not, it's either too loose or too tight. And so the under thread came up. Oh fuck. Now you see. Now machine sew the other side of the braid. And then I still gotta sh sew this by hand. The pockets still work, which is good. And then 
Gotta sew the end right here. I don't know why there's so many strings again. Cool. You can barely see them. The last part is to hand sew the pocket section because we want to have more control of where the thread is. Advice here is to sew vertically down the pants. You'll see that the first few stitches that I do are horizontal and it looks significantly worse than vertical stitches. There you have it. How to sew braids on the side of ASU pants. Let me know what you think down in the comment section. I would love to hear your feedback, questions, or suggestions on how to make this better. Thanks for watching.